Hey everyone, it's David coming to you today from my whiskey den here in central Ohio. My new whiskey den. Put this together, I did a video already kind of explaining it, so anyway. This is going to be my first review in my new whiskey den. And this bourbon I got this past spring. It is Henry McKenna 80 proof straight bourbon whiskey out of the Heaven Hill Distillery. And I couldn't really find much information on this. Oops, got the new bar. I got my glasses under here, so they're out of the way, but they're in the way, I guess. Uh, this cost me $15 down in Kentucky. Again, it's by Heaven Hill. The mash bill I found on it is 75% corn, 13% rye, and 12% malted barley. Is it malted barley? I think it is. Um, put that back under there. And I, the only the only thing I can really find is just the higher end um, versions, like the bottled and bond. I assume it's the same mash bill. I can't find an age statement on this. Um, I'm assuming it's going to be four years. Um, could be two years. I don't know. But uh, that's really all I know about it. And it's been sitting on my shelf. And I bought it because i never, ever seen it before. So let's take a gander at it, shall we? Let me grab a glass from under here. One of my little baby glasses. And one of the nice things about my new whiskey den is that I have a sink over here. Came out of an old caboose. But, uh, let's see. I haven't done a video in a while, even though I've been posting. I did a few of them before we started our renovation project down here. So, uh, let's see how rusty I am on this. So, let's see. Henry McKenna. There you go, Hank. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's get back into this. Um, kind of a light. Light brown color. <laughs> you know, it just smells like a $15 bourbon. Um, again, it is done by Heaven Hill. They know what they're doing when it comes to making bourbon. Um, let's see if we have any further information on here. No, 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 no. Uh, he founded the distillery in 1855. I don't think it's the same stuff that's in there, but let's see. It does have a bit of spice to it. It is pretty decent. I'm actually surprised. Ooh, I got that warm, fuzzy feeling. <clears throat> let's see. It is actually pretty smooth on the front of my tongue, but it has a bit of a harshness to it. It's not bad. It would be good, you know, it would be a go-to to mix into um, 7-Up or Ale One or something like that. Well, if you're in Kentucky, Ale One. If you visit Kentucky, you can buy Ale One. It is a, I think, a grapefruit, ginger, soft drink, soda pop. But, um, you know, I wasn't expecting a whole lot. It's, it actually has more character, in my opinion, than Jim Beam. It's definitely better than your Evan Williams or, um early times or Ezra Brooks but uh it's it's not like a $20 bottle um I don't know what else to say about it I mean it's decent it's okay will I rush out and get it again when I'm in Kentucky nah if I see the bottle and bond expression I'll get that to check it out and review but I mean it 
to me, the label even is pretty unremarkable and plain, but it's actually refreshing at the same time because it's not like looking like an Old West kind of thing. Well, you know, I, to me, I'm, it's not, it's not very remarkable. You might like it. It does have that higher uh, rye content to it. So it's got that bite and that spice, but it's not exactly my kind of, of sipping bourbon, drinking whiskey. But we'll leave it at that. I'll put it back on the shelf and the nice thing is with, with my whiskey then, if I have friends over, they've got a lot to choose from. And this will be on the on the docket for helping my friends sample and see what they think of it. Arr, arr. So anyway, until next time, this is David coming to you from my whiskey den here in Central Ohio. As always, I hope your next pour is your best pour, and we will catch you soon. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for my upcoming videos. Hey everyone, if you like what you see, please like and subscribe so you can be notified of future videos as they drop. Thanks for watching.